Erev Tov Harim, I'm Stephen Benoon. You're watching Israeli News Live. You are actually getting to see live footage of the planet Mars. I'll be showing you some actual photos that I've taken with a much stronger lens here earlier this evening, but this one doesn't shake quite as bad. Here are regular uh, studio broadcasting Sony here powered right on into the planet here. It actually appears uh, in a little bit earlier, it appeared even more red at the time, which you'll see in some of the photographic images. Just above it is the moon. Uh, already RT News uh, this evening has actually uh, brought out a broadcast how that this, uh, this weekend, especially Sunday in the evening skies, you'll be able to see uh, planet Mars as it will actually be in a perfect alignment uh, with the sun, the earth, uh, and planet Mars all being in an actual an alignment there. It does in our own skies here in the Czech Republic. It does have a little bit of a, of a yellowish orange look to it. And of course, as I have uh, looked at this this evening, my wife was the first one to actually see it in the sky. She didn't even know what it was at first herself, but I'd already seen the news broadcast from RT News, uh, knowing that it was actually uh, the planet Mars. Uh, but what's interesting, though, is I can only imagine the conspiracy theorist will actually be saying it's not planet Mars, it's planet X coming in. But I don't think that that's really the case. I don't want to get everybody all nervous, but, uh, but it is interesting and, and quite a marvel to behold uh, to see it like this uh, standing out so bright in the sky as it is right now. Uh, I believe it is also Bob Fletcher who has actually uh, stated that when Planet X gets near that they will actually say that it's only uh, like Planet Jupiter or Planet Venus or something of that nature there. Uh, but in reality he says it will actually be Nibiru or Planet X that is actually getting closer to the Earth. Well if that is the case, if this is what we are really looking at is Planet X and not Mars, maybe this is why we're starting to see the increased uh, number of earthquakes or their intensity, we might say. Well, only time will tell. But as far as I'm concerned right now, we're looking at Mars tonight, lining up as usual. We do see these things every couple of years, and Mars does get in alignment with the Earth and with the Sun. Just like we see other alignments that occur quite frequently as time goes by, Jupiter and Venus and Mars when they all line up, etc. Nonetheless, God has done an awesome creation for us. To get us let us behold the, the beautiful views of the stars and planets at night. I'm Stephen Benoon. You're watching Israeli News Live. Shalom. Have a good evening.